All right, well, now's a good time for us to conjure some of our food and water. We have to rebuff anyway. And we have to make more of our own food so that the number of them that we make per cast increases. I'm thinking that the regular old tigers have to be somewhere this way. Not sure. All I see is more young Stranglethorn Tigers. Where could they be? I know that around here somewhere are Panthers as well, but I don't even know that we need Panthers yet. Oh yeah, we do. Okay, well, maybe we'll find some Panthers this way at least. I can't lose that. We will see. Gorillas that we don't need. More young Stranglethorn Tigers. And of course we aggro this guy. And if we're not careful, we're going to aggro like three or four more of them. Yep, here he comes to ruin our day. Let's go over here. Oh good. Oh good, he did manage to call his buddy. That's perfect. Obviously, that's exactly what we wanted to have happen. My mana is low. Ah, uh, your mana is so low. This is not good. I can't cast that yet. I really don't know why. You need to. Oh, good, they reset anyway. All right, maybe coming over here, not such a good idea. Lots of gorillas, uh, not a lot of anything that I remember being over here, which was panthers and regular tigers. So, unsure. Hmm. Emblazoned Gloves. Agility, Stamina, Leather. Will probably sell for 20 silver on the auction house if I bothered to put it up. I don't know if there's anything at Refuge Point for Horde. But Maybe we'll check it out. Maybe that's not a good idea. I don't know. It's probably, I guess, is it the, is that the only Alliance camp here? I can't even remember if this is an Alliance only camp or if this is something like, well, like Nessing Wary where it's, oh yeah, this is, Definitely the Alliance camp. It's not gonna do anything for us except get us killed. Now we've crossed the bridge for no good reason. You can tell because of all the Alliance players running back to it. Uh, what kind of wildlife do they have going on right over here? Let's see. Mm. 
nothing alive right now. Okay then, well. Aha. Somewhere around here there are young panthers. I can't remember if these are the ones that are in stealth. That was unusual. We'll go ahead and skin somebody else's leavings, hoping for that heavy leather, but not getting a lot of it. No, these panthers are not stealth. It must be the older ones that are. I'm out of range. Oh, good. There's just two of them for some reason. That's that's great. That's really good. You go away. Let's get a little bit of distance, but not too much distance because we don't want to become crocolisk food. Alright, so we know where some of the panthers can be found, that's good. Still not sure about the regular old Stranglethorn tigers. Would like to hit some um, areas where it will reveal the map for us, that's kind of what I'm probing for right now, is hoping to get somewhere that has a name so that it can show me what the map looks like over here. Uh, we're coming upon Kurtzen Jungle Fighters. Okay, we don't need these guys, but maybe I can get this to reveal the map. Kurzen's compound. Okay. Perfect. Let's fill this in a little bit. So that we'll have a better idea of where to go in the future. Because we're going to be here for a long time, if I hadn't said that already. It goes to act like we can skin it, and then it says that it's tapped. Here's a regular old Stranglethorn Tiger, just the type we need. It's too far away. It is. It is getting quite far away, that's true. Oh good, that didn't stop him. Now we'll blink. There's right there a panther who was actually in stealth. Um, okay, so they can stealth. Good to know. He didn't aggro us, uh, surprisingly. So, we got lucky. Let's recoup some mana. And we'll go for him.
So we kind of hit the jackpot right around here. It seems like there's quite a few panthers. And those can be sometimes the more elusive cats to find here in Stranglethorn. Oh, nice resist. Just right away to screw us. One day we'll be able to afford a respec. Right now we can't. Um, we're not going to be able to respec until after we have a mount. That's really the only responsible thing that we can do at this point. We've wasted some of our talent points. So I've made some questionable decisions. Thought we were going to be able to do some AoE group kiting, but that did not ever, ever pan out. Mainly, partially because I'm bad at it. Probably mainly because I was bad at it. Secondly, because then I feel like the goal is just to grind mobs as a way to level, and I'm never going to do that. Not in World of Warcraft. Um, okay. These are the humans that we don't actually need right now. We might as well put this back on cooldown. I'm out of range. Yeah, but just barely. It's too far away. It's the worst when they walk out of range while you have one in motion because you can't start that that second cast right away. That's that's the worst feeling gameplay wise. And you know it's going to happen, and you know that there's nothing you can do about it once you've, once you've released that cast. There may be another area with more of the normal tigers. Since we've really only seen a few over here. It seems like this is more panther territory than anything else. We should really look for two more panthers and be able to finish that one up. But I do see another tiger over here that we'll grab first. And we're going to do that because this area seems pretty active. I don't want to... Oh no, this is a young... This is a young Stranglethorn tiger. We don't need him. Let's, let's get back over this way. 
Young. Okay, let's keep going. Aha. Something we need, something we need. If we get closer, because today's been the day of enemies walking away from us. There we go. Definitely a good area to look for panthers, guys. Regular tigers, not not so much. Unless they're just more out this way than we've been. Just more young panthers over here. Lots of panthers. It's just obviously like very much panther territory. Here we go. Here is a tiger. We'll wait for this guy to drop on us. Or off of us, rather. There he goes. I'm out of range. Are you? Well, by like one step, yes. Goblins, venture company geologists that we don't need yet, but uh, good to make note of. Let's see if maybe we can. There we go. We get close enough to reveal the map there. Perfect. And we'll use these guys as cover maybe to swim across the the lake here. Okay, we've uncovered all of that. Perfect. And let's go ahead and skin their leavings. I'm wondering if we look more in this area for tigers, or if we move on and hunt them somewhere else. I mean, granted, we saw a few, but... We're just seeing a lot of panthers now that we don't need. And I'm not really seeing any tigers. We killed a few, but they either haven't respawned yet or we just haven't come across them. Either way, we, we do need to be finding an area with something that we actually need. Maybe we will head across the lake here. Okay, and then this was the area with all the gorillas. This has young tigers and gorillas in it. Neither of which we especially need. Uh. 
and a bunch of the young Stranglethorn Tigers. I can't believe he's still following us. There he goes. All right, let's turn in well the Panther quest. Now we're ready to turn it up notch. If you want to prove yourself worthy of socializing with the likes of these big game hunters, you'll need to prove that you can kill 10 regular old Panthers. These big boys are tougher. They're not as easy as the young ones as you were killing earlier. The Alliance. Yeah, we, we got the idea. All right, uh, well, Let's just head, maybe we head up to this plateau and see if we get any regular tigers up there. It's kind of one of the easier to reach places that we haven't checked out yet. That's still recharging. I think there's an easy way up way back here. And there's probably some trolls up here as well. Let's take care of this one just because he's in our way. Aha! Well, we weren't really looking for you, but we'll take it. I'm glad we turned that quest in before we came over here. Got the follow-up. Yeah, they can just keep all dropping the bristly whiskers and anything else that can vendor for a lot, and the heavy leather is good. Yeah, I think we can get like one or two gold a stack of heavy leather. I have about two stacks in the bank, and then the stack we've accumulated. The the medium leather is like it sells for twenty silver, guys. It's it's like yeah, it's probably more than you're gonna get vendoring it, but it's hardly worth it. We are gonna tag this guy before he does. Don't usually do that, but we've kind of been camped out here for a second, so he's definitely ours. Definitely taking him. Venture Company Miners over there, we still don't need them. Stranglethorn Tiger Corpse, okay, so... There are some regular tigers up here as well as the regular panthers here on the plateau. Somebody is not looting their corpses because I can't skin any of this stuff. That's very wasteful. Very wasteful. There's level 34. That means we should have skills that we actually will want to train. And we could do that at the end of the episode. I'll teleport us back to Ogremar some point soon and we will learn those skills. I don't know if we'll be so lucky as to get another rank of Conjure Water so early, but we'll see.
That was a painful resist. Painful for us. I'm out of range. Oh shit. Looks like that rogue tagged him. He must have been in stealth. I didn't see him standing there or else we we definitely would not have went for that. Can we pull this guy by himself and maybe get some troll stuff that we need? Let's find out. Well, we're not going to do it like that. We'd like to pull him out a little bit. I'm out of range. He seemed confused for a minute. Let's eat and drink. We'll then try to get across here, grab this other panther. Maybe if we go a little further, we'll get like an actual map reveal up here. I don't want to walk through all these trolls, but... This has to be a specific area. There we go. Ruins of Zolkunda. Okay. Good to know. That way, when a quest tells us to go there, we will know exactly where we're going. Let's get this other panther. I saw the raptors down here. I need to get closer. So that's convenient for us. He got a lucky daze off on us there. I was okay waiting for Blink in that situation. I guess there are no young raptors. It's too far away. Like there are young everything else. It just goes right to strangle the raptor. I feel like by the time you're done with some of these initial hunting quests that you've ground out at least a full level of, of experience 
which is probably the intention to test yourself against the local creatures and see if you're ready to be in Stranglethorn for the rest of forever. Our mage is almost ready. I need to get closer. Like I said, I would have liked to be level 35 before coming here, but things don't always shape out how you'd prefer. Keep this going. I see a lot of raptors right here. I'm out of range. We should take care of this guy. I'm getting like bad flashbacks of that one scene in Jurassic Park. It's too far away. Like, right from behind our peripheral vision comes a I'm raptor attack. He's acting like he doesn't care about us, but he was giving us the side eye. And then this guy back here too is doing the same thing. I didn't even see him till just now. Okay, let's clear out these guys behind us. That's the other problem with Blink. You take a few steps first and you already have blinked out of range. Troublesome. Troublesome Blink. Now we're gonna go for this guy. I know he's lurking back there somewhere. Yeah, he has a little path that he walks. I need to get closer. Ugh, ugh, he has quite a path that he walks. Now he's too close. Now he resisted, and he's too close. And we're about out of mana. We can grab this panther. Getting our buffs back up would be a great idea. Those have probably been gone for a little while now, I'm sure you guys noticed. cringe every time I see a resist. I just keep thinking about those three points that we could have an elemental precision, that we have an improved blizzard right now that we're not using. If we spent every single penny we had, I still don't even think we could afford to respec. I don't think we could afford it. We have to get some better water soon. Maybe at level 35 we'll be able to buy better water. This was level 25 water, so I'm hopeful that means that in one more level we will be able to buy water that is more effective.
I'm out of range. Well, you're controlled by someone with apparently poor depth perception, so I'm not surprised that you're out of range so very often. Our bags are looking a little full, so we'll have to remember to empty those out. I believe there's a place back in Nessingwari's camp where we can do that. One of them has to be a merchant of some kind. Now that last frostbolt would have been just another big waste of mana. That, as you can see, we can ill afford to waste, really. Not if we want to keep uh, going a, a decent clip. Last two raptors, that'll wrap up the raptor mastery. If we get the other panther behind us and one more, that will wrap up the panther mastery. Then we could take them both back to the base camp. And then I'm sure we'll run into more t regular tigers as we look for the next levels of these creatures. <laughs> and then we turn around and everything has respawned behind us. Very, very cool. Let's take this path. Our warrior friend here has us covered. That's still recharging. And let's grab this panther. I need to get closer. If we're really lucky, we'll get the other one over there. If not, we'll go that way. So we have two options. Should be able to wrap this up, though. As long as we don't pull this guy and just get annihilated, because we're really low on mana, actually. Very, very low on mana. Good news is, evocates up. Plenty of panthers to choose from now, plenty. Wasted. We clipped into the wall and didn't go anywhere.
Random guild invites. Oh, good. We're running the worst possible path to get back to Nessingwary. That's still recharging. Apparently, we're going to survive. Don't mind if I do. Now let's step up the challenge and see if you're up to it. Venture into the jungle and bag yourself ten of those bloody lashtail raptors. Let's see what you've got. Safe travels. Need help? Now the hard part. A true panther hunter can show skill by dropping shadow maw panthers, the deadliest in Stranglethorn. Prove to us that you can slay ten of these beasts. If you think they are hard to track, wait until you attempt to slay one. Be careful. So these guys are going to be the ones that are in stealth. Okay. Uh, perfect. 